Hello and welcome to Let's Play Futurama with me, Mr. Muck Luckable. In the last episode, well, we had a hefty cutscene that told us quite a lot. Basically, Mum stole Professor Farnsworth's head <laughs> and threw us into the sun. So we landed on the sun, we met some guy called Ra Ra, apparently the sun city's been taken over by an evil sun god and we need to go and open the sealed temple and defeat the sun god defeat the bone army and just be amazing and in the process get some dark matter to get the hell off of the sun. I hope you got all that. Um, so we're going to carry on straight away. Let's go into the uh, next mission which is at the market square. I always say, never send a man to do a man's job. What? Okay, fine, Leela. Your hair is looking slightly better. Slightly. It's looking less bright pink, looking slightly more purplish, in my opinion. Only a little bit, though. Uh, so, yeah, here we are. We are in the market square of the Sun City. And already we can see a lot of enemies. It's currently telling us how to do some combat. Um, I may have mentioned before, but Leela is a lot like Bender, doesn't have a gun, it's more melee. So, let's have a quick go at the controls, shall we? Uh, obviously, B on Xbox is still jump, um, A is kick, hoya, hoya, and X is punch. Um, and you can do jump kicks, like that. Some nice things that, um, and obviously we have the special attack, which is X and A at the same time, but I'm not going to do it just yet because we only have one left. As you can see, there's only one little dot lit up to the side of our health. But we'll get some more. It's just basically a nice strong strong attack that will defeat most things. What Leela has going for her, apart from her uh, first person view, which literally should be one eye, um, is she has, because she's more agile and more, uh, well, yeah, agile is a good word. She can do rolls. Look at this. Ooh, she can do front rolls, back rolls kind of side rolls around. He's noticed us. Oh, they both noticed us. Let's quickly get rid of these guys. As you can see, they are just skeletons with little shields. And damn, they, they took a lot of health from us then. They ganged up on us. We better go find some health uh, before we take on some more. But there's a few different variants of those um, skeleton people we will meet. Let's just have a look at... Ah, this is Leela's collectible stuff, so... It's mine! All oh, mine! Good. We've got a couple of things there. We got the uh, collectible, which is now gold. We've we've had money. We've had robobium crystals, and now we've got gold bars. That's not too shabby. And also our health. I think we just picked up one. Is is a bit is a bit plain to be honest. It's um I think they're just like pills, like general vitamins. I I, I guess that's what it is. Um. Yeah. So now full health again. Thirty one lives. Oh yeah. Let's go take on some more of these uh, these annoying skeletons. Basically, this whole first level in the market square is just attacking people over and over and over again. We're going to get waves of people. Uh, so here's a second one. We have those first lot that kind of charge at you with uh, swords and shields. This one has like a shooty gun thing. So maybe they're more like... Oh! Oh no! <laughs> here's another type. I should have probably... Oh! Oh, damn it! Oh. What was I saying? They're kind of more like robot skeletons if they have those shooty guns. But yeah, that one over there that just died and took away half of our health nearly. They're like kamikaze skeletons. They just run at you with a bomb. Evil little things. They're, they're like the most annoying ones. Because if you get... A... Ooh. If you get a couple of them, you're screwed. That skeleton has skin on it. You're absolutely screwed. <laughs> oh, okay, that's good. That's unlocked some more of them. Oh my god, they're really creepy. We've got to run away really quickly though, because there's two bomb ones after us. Uh, let's. Sometimes you can make them run into the lava. Oh god, we need health. We need health. Oh, there's another bomb one. Oh, we, we're so dead if he gets us. Come on, fall into... Yes, I think he fell in the lava. 
Ah, <sighs> sometimes if you cut the corner of that lava, they just they just run straight into it because they're stupid. But you see those other guys, not too much trouble at all. You can just run past them. But those oh, those bomb people. Right, there's some health, good. Um. Hmm. Aha! I hope this is a nibbler. I didn't want to break those boxes if. Ah, oh, thank goodness. If I broke those boxes, that means we wouldn't be able to get up here. But here's a nibbler. Oh, pretty! Well, he would be. He's your pet. Um, two nibblers in this level. That's nice. Um, yeah, because these are just. You can destroy those, so then you'd be yeah, you'd be stuck. Oh, let's go take on these guys. Nice, got a bit of health now. Oh, it's weird how they talk. Like you wouldn't expect them to talk, but they do, <laughs> and they say quite weird things as well. Are you, are you a bomb one? Yeah, he is. You can hear the ticking. That's a bomb. Come on. Crap! 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 Sometimes, yeah, sometimes you can just outrun them, but often they're very sneaky and fast. Is that another one over there? No, that's a sword guy. That's a sword guy. Oh, look right at that. In the funny <laughs> right in the face, more like. That was right in the face. Um, I think these are destroyable as well, yeah. Destructible, even. Destroyable. <laughs> Great English. They're destructible and also quite aptly. Yeah. Shut up, Leela. We have uh, over here. Ow. Ow. Uh, there we are. We have sunflowers on the sun. Isn't that beautiful? Nothing in them, though. Oh, well. We just like destroying things, to be honest. Anything opened up? Oh, yep. Yeah. At least they give you like a sound warning. Oh. By the skin of our teeth, we... Oh. We, we got rid of that. Mm. Eat food, baddie. You can't just spam them like that as well, though. Why, if it isn't the pre -undead. Oh my god. Pre undead. There's so many of these guys. There's one right behind me. I can't move yet. Run right away. You can also see that thing in the middle has uh, I'm bleeding. risen up. Psych. But we'll deal with that in a minute. Let's just get rid of these guys. And actually, there's some quite, quite nice little details you can look at in this level as well, which we're going to have a, a quick look at before we end it. It's not a terribly long one. <laughs> not a terribly long one, this first level. But some of Leader's levels do get ridiculously long. They really do. Okay, is that everyone gone? Everyone dealt with? Let's go in some of these rooms. I think one of them has a nibbler in it. There's some health. Good. Good, good, good. Uh, I want to try and get some of these gold bars as well because they're very useful. Oh, another charge up. Oh, that's what they're called, charge up. Fine. Um, I really hope there's a nibbler. Another charge up. And nibbler? I suppose we'd be able to hear him, wouldn't we? It's mine, all mine. Oh no. I don't know where the other nibbler is. I thought he was in one of those rooms. <gasps> I hope I haven't missed the poor little guy. No, okay. Well, um, yeah, let's go down here and have a look at some of these signs. I actually think he's maybe at this end. I want to have a quick check now. Are you in this room, Nibbler? No. Oh, Nibbler. <laughs> Please. I feel really bad if I've missed him. Plus, we need it. We're collecting all of them. Oh, Nibbler, there you are, you sneaky little guy. I'll just help myself to one of these. Alright, good. So that's all Nibbler's got. I was a bit worried there. But here's some of the nice little touches, right? You see uh this section over here? It's called Tanning. Look at the look at the deck chairs, look at the shadows on them. They've got Nibbler shadows. Oh look at that. I'm not quite sure why. I mean I understand the importance of Nibbler shadows in future armor. I really did like that kind of aspect where they put in the shadow. Um, in the first episode, and then they came back to it ages on late, later on, and kind of explained why there was a shadow there, and all that kind of planning. I love that kind of pre-thought. Like you put all that much that much work into it to 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 make some interesting storylines about going back in time and stuff. So yeah, nibbler shadows, quite nice. 
Uh, there's also a, a shadow of Fry. I think that's Fry anyway, look at that. That's got to be Fry, isn't it? You can tell by the kind of mouth and the hair. So, <laughs> there's another shadow. Some of the signs are quite funny as well. Uh, wait an hour after eating before swimming in lava. Always good advice. Uh, raincoats have had a serious drop in price uh, on the sun. So now they're free. Uh, let's smash some of these as well for some mindless violence. What's the other one? There's another sign here as well. Uh, sunblock SPF 1000 plus. Mm-hmm. And also... Oh yes, we've got to know what the weather's like on the sun. So the forecast is sunny. All week. Well, that's useful. Uh, and I think that's pretty much it. I'm just going to collect some more of this gold around here. Yeah, Lena makes some weird noises sometimes, don't mind her. So all that's left to do is to go activate that pressure plate in the middle there. You see there's like a kind of pressure plate there? Kind of reminds me of a bit of Mario with these fireballs though. In fact, it is exactly like Mario. What am I talking about? Let's time this right. Ugh. Now you can't walk through there, I think we have to roll. So, roll. Ooh, that's a bit dodgy. And go. And I think it starts sinking. The platform we're standing on starts to sink after him. <laughs> after this cutscene. Oh man, look at all those guys. Oh, it is as well. Quickly, run. No. Oh, what a what an awful jump. Awful jump. And oh no, I haven't got it. This oh. is gonna kill you more than it kills me. Thought I'd do it all over again then. Um, but I kind of want to kill all these guys and collect the boxes again. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I uh, just went around and got all the gold bars again, killed all the enemies, and also, in the process, learned a new move that I forgot to show. Uh, if, you, if you're kind of running forwards like this, and then you press A, you do like a running jump kick. Look at that. See? Oh yeah, doesn't work if you're running any, any other direction. Oh yeah, it does. Oh, look at that. I'm such a liar. Um, Alright, let's try this again. I really don't want to mess up this jump, though. So let's do this. Yeah. Uh, okay, we can skip that. Jump. Roll. No! Jump! Oh, I thought I was going to roll off the edge. Okay, there's bomb guys. Come on, cut the corner. Fall in the edge. Fall in... Yes! Did you see that? He just fell in the lava. These guys, not really that much of a problem, unless I think that's a... Is that a bomb guy standing on top of the stairs? It might be. Yeah, it is. It is. I know it is. This is gonna kill you. Yep, there he goes. Oh, he, oh! I think this guy just shot him. Huh? They can actually fight each other, I think. But if you get one shooting another one, they will start fighting, which is pretty funny. Um, and I think that's probably about it for this level. Man, that was such a stupid death. I was doing so well. But yeah. Uh, all that's left to do is walk into this room, and that will be that. Ta-da! Market Square done. Let's have a quick look at the stats, though. Oh, we got all the gold bars as well! Um, two out of two nibblers, 50 out of 50 gold bars. Not all the kills, which is stupid, I guess. If they fall into lava, it doesn't count as your kill, which is stupid. Um, but yeah, pretty good. So the next level is the left wing. So until next time, thank you for watching. And goodbye.